Previously on The Walking Dead. Shut up, Carly! Ugh, I've heard enough out of you! Now, what the fuck's the problem? Damn, R.I.P., bro. Just get in. Figure out what to do with you. I was trying to protect all of us. Holy shit! She's stealing the RV! I don't know much about you folks. She can get can little with the you, RV. Sure the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. Y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do we do? Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. We should go our own way when we get there. The crew is falling apart. You and I are stronger alone. I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. We gotta jump! What? No way! Look at him. Goofy, man. He just pushed his fucking bone right through the skin. And you be sure to find me whether Lee wants you to or not. Now, what I need. Who the fuck? Y'all might want to rethink your plan. Just for a little while, we're getting real close to where my mom and dad are. Maybe I can... Not now. I need you to focus. Keep your attention on the street. Okay. Sorry. How's Oneed? His leg's pretty bad. I'm fine. You're not fine. You need to rest. He needs to rest. Yeah, you're right. Kenny, hold up. Kenny, god damn it, I said hold up. Only needs to take a break. break. Let's give him a minute. We're almost at the river. Almost to the boats. And it won't hurt to stop for just one damn minute. What the hell? Maybe this city's not so dead after all. Keep moving. No one's ringing that bell. It's automatic. On a timer. What kind of church bell goes off at 20 past the hour? Someone's up there! Are you sure? I don't see anything. I know what I saw. I'm telling you there's someone up in that bell tower. Someone alive! I thought you said that thing didn't work. Hello? Hello? Are you there? What the hell was that? Is someone trying to fuck with us? Sounded more like a warning. Ask not for whom the bell tolls. What are you yammering on about? Mm. Man, speaking that philosophy. It tolls for thee. Everyone! 
Everybody, run! Clean him up. Kenny, how's that door coming? I'm working on it. I'm working on it. We'll work faster, would you? Won't be long before those things outside figure out where we went. You know they can smell blood. Let me see if I can find us a way in. <laughs> Looks like something was buried here. to doghouse. Never not useful. What's this? Looks like there's some kind of pet door here. I tried it already. That's locked too. Who the hell ever heard of a locked doggy door? I have. My neighbor had one just like that. It's it's radio controlled. The dog wears a collar with a chip in it, so the door only opens when the dog gets close to it. Well, shit. Every day's a school day. All right, so where's the dog? Is a uh, bird. Hey, be careful. Digging up dead things isn't what it used to be, you know what I mean? Yeah, I hear you. Hey Clementine, I'm really not cool with you right now, I'm not gonna lie. Nothing. Clem, go over and sit with Chris. Talking to some weirdo okay. on the walkie talkie. Just do what I say, okay? Oh god, the smell. Get it off. Ugh. Okay, that is not Jesus. cool. Are you okay? I'm fine, honey. It's just the smell. 
Are you sure you're... I said I'm fine, okay? Bro, with the dirt back on, bro. Get inside. How do you feel hurt? Will we be inside soon? Yeah, not much longer now. I hope so. It's getting cold out here. How you guys doing? Not great, so long as we're stuck out here. Will you please go figure out a way to get us inside? Okay, that's a funny way of telling me to go focus on getting inside. Here goes nothing. Yes! God damn! You see anything in there? No. Looks like it's been empty a while. Whatever you're gonna do, do it fast. Okay, let me see if I can reach up in there. Be careful, man. Mm. It's no good. I can't get it. Here, let me try. I think I can... Pim, are you okay? Say something! Good job, Clem. Yeah, way to go. I did good, right? Yes, you did. You did good. Can we maybe have this conversation inside? My leg's starting to hurt like hell. Hey. Looks okay from here. Everybody in. Okay, I'm good. Feel better already just being off my feet. Thanks, babe. So, when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Tell you what? That it's working. That there's someone else on the other end of that thing. You didn't think that might have been worth sharing with the rest of us? I was gonna tell you. Kenny and I only found out yesterday. So both of you were keeping it from the rest of us. Great. Who gives a shit about the damn radio? I'm more worried about whoever it was out there ringing that bell and bringing the dead down on top of us. It's like they didn't want us to make it to the river. What makes you think it's not the same person? Whoever was on the radio was close enough to see us in the street, and we didn't see anyone else other than the guy in the bell tower. Because that doesn't make a lick of damn sense. Why would they bring out the dead like that and then try to warn us about it? How much sense does anything make anymore? In case you haven't noticed, there's a lot of twisted folks out there these days. At least the dead don't play games with you. I don't know who it was. All I know is they're no friend of ours. Damn right. I'm telling you, they don't want us getting to the river. Maybe they want those boats all to themselves. But we'll see about that. I'm not going back out there anytime soon. Omid needs to rest. I think we could all use a little time to rest up and gather our thoughts, Kenny. At least until those walkers outside wander off and Omid's feeling better. He best feel better quick. I ain't gonna wait around here too long. He best get better soon, cause uh... <laughs> I ain't gonna be waiting around here to- Please seem secure at least. I'll Man, shut better the fuck when up. We, know that for sure. we need to check the whole house. <sighs> Alright, fine. You and me will take the upstairs. Lee, you've got down here. Make sure you check every door. Understand? Man. Okay. I'm gonna lie to you. Can you... I help? What if there's another locked door? I think you you've been die. helpful enough for one day, kiddo. Why don't you just see if Kristen Omid need anything, okay? Okay. Dog food. Alright, get you 
dot that water is off. All empty. Probably not the best idea right now. I need to stay frosty. Whiskey open though. Looks expensive and heavy. Doubt any looters would be able to haul that thing too far. All clear in here. Right. Like you see how that went away? Do everything like that. Nothing hiding in here. Just one more to check. Holding up okay? I hope this house is safe. Have you checked all the rooms to make sure? No, but I'll take care of it. ain't got much. We should be okay here for a while, at least until it quiets down outside. Good. Thanks. Is he okay? Yeah, for now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. Don't suppose you turned up any meds while you were poking around? Nah, just some whiskey. I was just asking Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell us. Who is he? What does he want? Go ahead, Clem. It's okay. You're not in any trouble. It's just a friend. I don't think he wants to hurt us. What has he been saying to you? What have you been saying to him? I told him I was trying to find my parents and that they were in Savannah. He really seems nice. I think he wants to help me find them. Clementine, honey, trust me, that's not what he wants. He... Lee? Lee, you need to get up here now. What's wrong? It's Kenny. Kenny said he thought he heard something up there. Went to go look. He's up there? I can't get him to come down. Stay here. Ben. I'm over with you, dude. I'm not gonna lie. Kenny? Kenny? You okay, man? Oh, Jesus. What the hell is that? Oh, my God. Kind of looks like duck, don't he? It's just a kid. What the hell happened to him? Ain't nothing on him. Guess he must have been hiding out up here. Starved to death. Do 
Jesus Christ. I don't know if I can, Lee. Couldn't do it before. Can't do it now. Before it was your own son. Now it's just a kid who needs your help. You can do this, Kenny. You need to do this. I know. I just... Oh, God. This must have been where he slept. Here. This'll make it clean and quick. I don't know that I can do it, Lee. It's okay. I'll take care of it. Should have made him do it. Poor kid. Must have tried to hide out up here until he starved to death. <laughs> this could have been Clementine if I hadn't found her right here. Weak ass zombie. I'm sorry. Hey, maybe we was right to fucking smash bro head with that salt lick. Cause boy. We should bury him. I'll take care of it. Nobody shouldn't want to bury this nigga, bro. What? This nigga living through, uh, I think this duck. See a dog. Right. Now this is what I call useless gameplay. Seen this though. I want to do this. None of us knew. Pure pitter pattering with the dirt. You hear? Lee, what's going on?
I saw someone standing there by the fence, watching us. A walker? No, too fast. Took off like a bat out of hell when I spotted him. Was it a man or a woman? Didn't get a good enough look. What does it matter? I'm wondering if it's the same guy who's been following us. The guy on the radio. Kenny? I'm fine. Just... I'm fine. What's all the ruckus? Lee saw someone watching us from outside the gate. What? Who? I can't be sure. They ran off before I could get a good look. I don't like this one bit. Not one bit. Me either. Walkers are one thing, but the thought of someone out there actually stalking us. All right, that's it. We've stuck around here long enough. It's time to get back on track. Time to get down to the river and find ourselves a boat. I don't know if Omid's well enough to move yet. Well, he better get ready, because I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. And as soon as she's ready to go, we're moving out. We only checked the house to make sure it's secure. We didn't really toss the place. We're low on food, water, meds, ammo. We should make sure there's nothing here we can use before we move out. Will you search it if you wanna? I'm done with this house. We came to this city to find a boat, and that's just what I'm gonna do. Maybe it's not such a bad idea to check the place one I more- I said I'm done with this house! Who the fuck gave you the reins? This is why I was trying to leave with Lily, bro. This is why I was trying to leave with Lily. I didn't want to deal with both. this shit. Ben, you take one last look around the place. Grab anything that looks useful. While me and Kenny go down to the river to get us a boat. Uh, she was a little bit more. My mom and dad That's not why she now. shot Carly. Maybe she shot Carly because she thought Carly river. was a thief. This dude is. Daylight's burning. Gonna go grab my gear, then we'll head out. Come on, Clem. Let's go see if Omid needs anything. So, you're just gonna leave me on the bench here? No offense, Ben, but I'd feel safer if you stayed here. How am I supposed to not take offense to that? What am I, a liability? Yes. Great. Just great. Thanks a lot for the vote of confidence. Confidence is earned, Ben. And you've got a long way to go to earn yours back after some of the stuff you pulled. You feel me? Yeah. Yeah, I feel you. Bro, me. I do not. I didn't fuck with him when I seen him. I don't fuck with him now. This adolescent child. Hey, uh, so you want to talk about it? About what? About what happened back there, in the attic. No. You sure, man? I mean... River's we... right up ahead. Let's do Kenny on one. Son of a bitch. That bastard's fucking with us again. It's another trap. No, listen. That's not the same bell as before. This one's further off. Whatever it is, it's gonna get the dead moving over there. What the hell is going on? I have no idea, but someone must be ringing those bells. 
Whatever, man. I find whoever's doing that, I'll ring their motherfucking bell for them. Good one. Let's keep moving. I gotta be purposefully done. Strategic. Still nothing moving behind us. I think we're... Oh my god. There's gotta be a boat. There's gotta be. Are you sure about that? Doesn't look like it to me. Hey, we need to start thinking about the plan. B. This is the plan. It's the only one we've got, and you pissing on it in front of everyone like you did back at the house ain't exactly helping. Well, screw you. I ain't giving up that easy. Dude, a crybaby. I do not want to be with none of these people, bro. Me and Clementine's Audi. This one might still be salvageable. Seriously? We got a better fucking idea. I'll check it out. You look further along the waterfront. Maybe there's something at the other end. I don't think we should split up too far. We don't have to. See that telescope? You can see all the way along the waterfront from right here. See what you can find. Okay. Got a fucking quarter on you, bitch. I think I lost bro's change. Not exactly a welcome banner. Something like this. This barricade does a good job of making me not want to go any further. Using walkers like scarecrows. What sick bastard did this? Yeah, cause I'm gonna waste my bullet on one of them, right? You got a quarter on you? Don't have a lot of use for small change these days. Maybe you can find one on the street somewhere. Someone must have been trying to back their boat into the water. Only things didn't go as planned. Should probably stick close to Kenny. It's too dangerous out here. Kenny can't 
ain't no fucking help to us, bro. Nah, Kenny, not nah, Ben. Omid, probably, but he injured now. Krista, what about Omid? She got something going with her. Oh no, throwing up and shit. Fuck around and be pregnant. Retard. Going to get pregnant in the middle of the apocalypse for Must have taken weeks to board up all these windows. What's up with the boat? It ain't gonna work. Hull's cracked beneath the waterline, plus someone stripped out the battery. You can't fix it? What the... what the hell is that? A fate worse than death. Abandoned, like every other place in this city. Plenty of docks, no boats. No way that one's salvageable. Nothing but water. Not a boat to be seen. What the hell? Get down! Get down! Spider-Man doing here. Are we hiding? Someone came down from that building at the end of the street. Where'd he go? Saw him run into that newsstand. Could be our bell ringer. How about we go find out? Uh, maybe he's just another scavenger like us. Yeah, and maybe he ain't. Maybe he's that fucker on the radio who's been messing with Clementine's head. Don't you want to know? Because I want to know. Okay, you head up the middle of the street. I'll go around the side, cover your flank. Bro, we'll this dude, Kenny, is fucking weird. Why did they keep forcing me into decisions I'm not Just even doing? Talk to this guy. Oh, we're doing gonna weird talk. shit. Like, it don't even matter what I choose. This story already written. I'm putting my... Bro, she know. Look at her. How oh, far is it going? That boy know. Damn, I was too busy looking at the thing. Knocking me clean out. You're not from Crawford. That's a girl. I know a voice when I hear it. You're not the guy on the radio. I'm not a guy at all. Full marks for observation. Kenny, don't! Bro, 
I knew no, by the nice. way. I knew by the way she dug behind that that and the way she dug behind that thing when we came up. Who the hell are you people? Hey. Everyone just calm down. I'll calm down once she tells me who the fuck she is. Back off, asshole. The name's Molly. Molly? I'm Lee. This is Kenny and Clementine. We're not looking for any trouble. Hi. You guys really aren't from Crawford, are you? I don't even know what that is. Everything beyond that barricade. What the hell happened here? You sure you want to know? When everything started going to shit, some people got together and sealed off that whole neighborhood. Folks willing to do anything to stay alive, stop the dead getting in. I try to avoid them. Why? Let's just say they have a zero tolerance policy for anyone who won't or can't live by their rules. So how'd you know we weren't them? Because there are no children in Crawford. Not anymore. Do you know who's been ringing those bells all over town? Yeah, that would be me. I knew it! Lee, I knew she was the one who'd been following us! Fucking with us! Get that finger out of my face, Grandpa, before I jam it straight up your ass. I haven't <laughs> been following you. I don't even know who the hell you people are. Calm down, Kenny. The voice on the radio was a guy, remember? Yeah, well, whoever you are, ringing those bells this morning nearly got us all killed. Raised the dead all around us. That's the idea, genius. It's how I get around. I ring a bell in one neighborhood to attract the local geeks towards it. Buys me some time to scavenge the areas they cleared out. Geeks? Is that what you call them? Yeah, you know, like at the carnival? They'll eat anything, alive or dead. That's pretty smart, the bells. Doesn't take much to outsmart the dead. Oh, the women are running in too. You just gotta move fast. Get in and out before they start to wander back again. What do you mean, no children? Why not? No children, no elderly, no one with an advanced medical condition. Basically, no one who might be a burden on the community. Crawford's oh, all about the survival of the fittest. That's how they survived, while the rest of the world went to shit around them. Jesus Christ. Well, Had the right idea, the for the most part, sound like. Think about it. That's not how our group does things. You're not saying they actually... I mean, kids? No, the children, they just forced to leave. Along with their parents. Left them to fend for themselves out here in the world. Why? Like I said, zero tolerance. Crawford got rid of anyone that couldn't pitch in, hold their own weight. The way they looked at it, those people were just a lot of useless mouths to feed. A drain on their precious resources. How do you know all this? Everyone in Savannah knew. What was going on inside Crawford got passed around like a ghost story. Except this one was true. Well, I always just drive coming over. I don't understand. Look, I'm gonna ask you people again. You're not from Crawford, so who the hell are you? What are you doing here? Came down here looking for a boat, hoping to get our people out of here, find something safe. Yeah, good luck with that. Anyone with a boat took it out of here as soon as people started eating each other. Any that got left behind, Crawford stripped them for parts. Cars, too. There's gotta be something. If there was, do you think I'd still be here? I've been over every inch of this city. This whole place is picked clean. God oh, you damn it! Fuck! Hit the road, hey, Jack. moron. You want to keep your voice down? Since you're not getting on any boat, I'd advise you folks to go back to where you came from before. Great. Just great. Isn't that the, the way we came? Fuck. The gunshot must have brought him back. Isn't there another way back to the house? Mom, is there a. 
Ali said. Fuck all that. Is there another way out of here? Don't know, don't care. So what the hell are we supposed to do? I refer you to my previous answer. But you have to help us, please. Oh, thank God for Clementine. Come on, make it fast. Cause she most definitely would have left. Kill me first, oh, not Kenny. Come on, come on, hurry! How does a walker still bleed for real? Clementine, can you hear me? If you can hear me, just get back to the house, okay? I'll meet you there. Oh, yeah. Shit. Oops, sorry. Only you know what made you think of that. But. Touching that. Last thing I need is some god awful disease. Already infected, it sounds like, bro. So whatever disease is, is in the air. A man just walked up on it with no kind of plan, just... Good 
thing I'm out here. And not in there. Hmm. Right. Loose. Shit. Won't go anymore in that direction. Right. this way. Can't go the way I just came. Bro. Can you let me walk? Why is it not going? I'm trying to go down, but it's not letting me go down. Confusing ass too. They got me doing useless shit this episode still. one for himself. You deserve better, old man. I don't know why they kept having me go look for Chuck. Chuck is over with. Try to do that for real, bro. That's what I tried to do. No way I could pick that up on my own. Think he is? What the hell? Thought he was her? 